Hi guys, welcome to the channel, quick general love reading for my friends Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So let's find out together what's coming through for you, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the love arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys. And we are ready. So your energy is Ace of Pentacles, Nine of Wands, Four of Wands, High Priestess. Your person's energy is Seven of Pentacles, Temperance, Major Arcana, Five of Swords, Tricky Energy, Page of Cups, Meeting Energies, Two of Wands, Ace of Swords, Wheel of Fortune, and the Sun. Where is your happiness? Our focus, Seven of Wands, maybe not in this connection anymore. Bottom of the deck, Eight of Cups and the chariot also guys there can be an issue about commitment involved for some of you for others it can be it can be just that your person doesn't know what they want and so they are buying some time they are offering you page of cups energy but they are clueless and their stubbornness which can be a factor as our focus considering the seven ones can cost them the connection because they can be left behind wishing well there can be a wish coming from you guys about the four of wands ace of pentacles combination but if you realize that you cannot get it there can be a disappointment nine of wands but you can make a decision to go away kinda wishing well to this person but also moving in a different uh, direction you know gentle gardener this is a lovely energy someone that is willing to nurture a connection for example follow the leader if we have a leader in these energies it's the high priestess the temperance should be an encouragement for your person but they are falling short and so it's like you can decide to pursue a different path guys that can still bring you away from this person storm fields it's a tornado that can sweep away an illusion uh, there is a house that uh, seems to be just a mirage you know and one ring circus bottom of the deck it can be even the five of swords because the man in the five of swords thinks to be the center of the world in some sense and that's why the people surrounding him at some point can get tired and can go away compass there is also a frog in the oracle card and some of you can take a leap forward even if it means that this connection can go cold, deep freeze. So, a little bit harsh, guys, but it can be a necessary transition. Present. In this case, the current moment, guys, even if the Ace of Pentacles can be a gift, maybe you were willing to share it with this person, but they do not even know where they are. Seven of Cups. Forgiveness. This can be a, a factor because maybe your person has asked for your forgiveness multiple times already. And so uh, this can become a problem. Cause and effect. Here we go. A domino effect, I would say. Freedom, guys it seems the most uh, likely outcome bottom of the deck we have 
priorities, maybe also different priorities. Despite how important uh, the connection has been for a while, because we have the Wheel of Fortune, so there can be a meaningful amount of patience that has been granted in favor of this connection, and the Ace of Swords can be something like, look, wake up, otherwise I am going away, and it seems that we can go away, because the man in the Two of Wands is holding the ward, and your decision to end this connection can be justified by the realization, High Priestess driven, that your inner happiness is not here anymore. Let's see your person. Seven of Cups. The Lovers. Important connection, yes, but they are refusing a heart over head decision. Three of Cups. For them, it's fun. The connection is okay as it is. No third party situation, guys, in this scenario. If you resonate, maybe put the energies in perspective, but this is the fun part of the connection, which can even be about the intimacy, you know? But when this person thinks about other nuances, they are lost. They are lost. They do not know how to handle the situation. Let's see the Five of Swords. Super difficult to manifest a divine alchemy temperance related if there is an ego driven pattern at play. Hierophant. An issue about commitment. This person wants to win an argument, let's say. They want to prove a point when it comes to the opportunity to allow the connection to take a step forward. You want it, the A priestess. Maybe they are not willing to become the Hierophant as a counterpart. They are stuck. They do not see the opportunity as you do. The hanged man is upside down. And so, because of their stuckness, you can change your mind. Because they are not able to offer what you were hoping for, let's say. So, let's go for the A Priestess. Because you can become colder and colder. And this can puzzle your person even more. Because at some point, they are not uh, going to be able to understand you guys anymore. And so, it's even more challenging for them. Page of Wands. Teeny tiny bit of passion, but, you know, not enough. Not enough. Uh, because there is a legitimate desire for more. Knight of Swords, this can be about discussions. Because of the influence um, of the Five of Swords, which can be about, you know, petty fights, arguments, um, pointless altercations, you know. Stuck situation, Eight of Swords, and the Star, which is the energy that for me can guide the chariot to the promised land, let's say. No wish granted in this situation, because it's not progressing. And so, some of you can be legitimately disappointed. Defenses up for protection. It's like... You look at this person, and deep within you can think, Who are you? Because I was hoping for something more in favor of our connection, I have been patient because I was counting on the fact that something positive was uh, achievable, you know, together. But they keep uh, buying time, maybe just to please their ego, and now, now there can be a plot twist, and they are not going to like it, maybe, but... Uh, it can be a necessary plot twist for you. And so guys, let's go for the Wheel of Fortune, because it is the time factor, this one. The soulful decision can be resolved thanks to the Ace of Swords. It's a matter of inner happiness. It's a matter of honesty also, the Sun. Because it's about being clear 
and the star is about transparency. Here we go. Page of Pentacles, another page, considering the Page of Wands and the Page of Cups. Five of Cups, missed chance. There can even be a factor when it comes to the Three of Cups, if we think about a trip down memory lane. Regrets for this person. They are going to regret their actions. Because if this becomes a missed chance, because we couldn't go the distance together, basically, this person has played a huge role in that. Four of Cups, unavailable, out of reach. The big offer, let's say, the divine one, can be yours, Ace of Pentacles. This person, unavailable. And that's why we can embrace a singlehood moving forward, the Nine of Pentacles. But what's the point with the energy? For me, the point is that the lady is independent, she doesn't need anything from anyone, she is looking for a fair companion, but she has no interest whatsoever in unbalanced situations or connections. She is looking for someone that can share with her the Ace of Pentacles, even in order to build a Four of Wands partnership that is blessed by a common vision that can also see involved a uh, high priestess, high priest, hierophant combination of energies that can truly represent a source of fulfillment because we can shine even brighter because we are also together with a person that can share the same aspirations in favor of the partnership. Guys, if we decide to remain in a connection like this one, we are choosing to settle for something that is not enough and sooner or later the realization will kick in and the transition will still find a way to manifest that's why the wheel of fortune can be about life cycles and life chapters the point is that the sooner we make this awful decision the better because if the connection is just an illusion it can be wise to sweep it away in order to be available for something better or someone better. Guys, I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful. Let us know if you resonate. Comment, like, share, subscribe to the channel. Until next time, I wish you the best. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon.